What's up guys, Bloodburger here with you. Uh, so it's 3.45 a.m. Uh, April 3rd, 2012. Just got a brand new content patch for Soul Calibur V. Uh, they've given us some new equipment actually uh, in the Cepheus store. What you're going to want to do is uh, download the compatibility pack here that, I've have, that I have highlighted uh, and then it will give you access to the purchase downloadable content menu where you can actually download uh, each piece for either 160 Microsoft points. Um, I'm on an Xbox, sorry, I, I'm not going to do a PS3 conversion for you. Um, or 240 Microsoft points. So um, it consists of both male and female parts. I'm going to show off the male ones first. Uh, let's just go through the helmets here quickly. Uh, let's see. You've got Nightmare's Torment Helmet. Right. Uh, you've also got the Astroth Devil Mask. Uh, Bulldoze Iron Mask. And uh, Nightmare's Misery. You can see that it comes complete with hair from uh, Soul Calibur 2. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of those. You also get one more mask, but only Voldo can wear it. I'm not going to feature it in this video, but it's uh, his brown leather mask. Uh, you'll see it in the Cepheus story if you do decide to buy the headgear. Um, let's see here. Is there anything else for the male specifically? I don't think so. Oh, here we go. Okay, so you've got Outlaw Wear, which is actually pretty cool. Uh, you've got the Justice Sir Coat, Patroclus's Coat. And the Oathbearer's Raiment, which also belongs to Patroclus, I believe. Uh, let's see here, anything else? Ruffian Coat. It's pretty badass. Oathbearer Sash. It's pretty cool. Uh, no neck and back pieces for the males. Get Ruffian Gloves. Let me zoom in on those so you can see the detail. Outlaw gloves. Uh, you get a oath bearer's epaulette, shoulder piece. Nothing for the ankles. Uh, let's see here, ruffian boots. The Justice Boots. Both Bears Greaves. It's actually some really nice stuff. Uh, let's see, and I don't think there's any specialized equipment for the males or the females in this package. Just back out real quick and grab the female. I'm going to go ahead and use the lovely bone tits. Uh, you guys haven't seen her in a while, so show her some love. I've already seen the head stuff. There's nothing different for women. Um, on the face equipment, however, you get Elysium's Absolution Mask. Let me just zoom out a little bit, rotate around. Uh, for the undergarments, you get a one-piece swimsuit, standard swimsuit. 
Uh, you also get gym shorts. And I'm going to give you guys a quick hint on what you might be able to do with these. You also get a gym shirt. You know, a, few, a few ideas must come to mind when you see that. Uh, let's go through the other stuff. Mervalous dress. I know I'm pronouncing that wrong, sorry. Got a uh, French maid dress, outfit. Got the woeful Akaton. Let me get rid of these so we can just kind of focus on one piece at a time. It's uh, Pyrrha's alt costume. Alt fighting style as well. Uh, you get the Soothsayer's dress. Another character comes to mind when I see that. Uh, you get the Absolution Body Togi. And the Sorrowful Akaton. So for the tops, upper body pieces, uh, let's see, for lower body, for women, you get the sorrowful skirt. Absolution hip togi. Sexy see-through piece. A lot of us enjoy that. Um, woeful skirt. Hip, nothing for neck pieces. You get the Absolution to Choker. See Sayer's Hood. And the Lace Choker. Gloves, get the sorrow, sorrowful gloves. Absolution arm gear, which another another piece of Elysium's costume. See, there's glee, uh, sleeves. Excuse me, early. <laughs> set. Got your uh, cuffs. Marvelous gloves. Mer Mervalous? I don't know. I'm not a French teacher, so sue me. Uh, nothing for women on the shoulder or the ankle. Uh, for the feet, you have sorrowful boots. Absolution Solea. Uh, Soothsayer's Hose. knee highs over the knee right and I believe yeah there's no uh, specialized equipment for her so uh, that is the new patch all in all I, I think it's pretty cool for a creator like somebody like me who does a lot of uh, cause or CAS's I think it's pretty cool um, it was only about 10 bucks, so you know you can make the decision whether or not you want to spend money on this. Um, 
I thought it was pretty cool, so I went ahead and got it. Uh, anyhow, thank you for watching the video. Follow, subscribe, all that stuff. And uh, we'll catch you in the next one. Later.